This surprises people. Planes do not carry fuel in tanks like a car, and the wings are the fuel tanks. And that choice is structural, not convenient. On modern airliners, fuel is not added to the wing. It is built into it. That removes the weight of separate tanks. It uses existing structure instead of adding more. And it puts mass exactly where lift is generated. Every kilogram saved is performance gained. Here is the part most people never hear. In flight, wings bend upward under lift. Fuel inside the wing pulls downward. That counteracts bending, reduces stress at the wing route, and slows fatigue over tens of thousands of flights. The fuel is not just along for the ride, it is helping the wings survive. If fuel was stored in the body instead, wing bending loads would increase. The wing would need to be heavier. Plumbing and structure would multiply. Center of gravity control would get harder. Cars store fuel in tanks because they do not fly. Aircraft store fuel where it reduces stress. So here's the uncomfortable takeaway. Is wing fuel risky? Or is it actually one of the reasons wings last decades? Because in aviation, fuel in the wings is not a compromise. It is structural advantage disguised as storage.